areas in many fields concerned with risk management, such as engineering, environmental, reinsurance, but generally ignored in finance for many years. Also, for instance, heavy tails have been detected in financial returns for more than 20 years. With the last financial crisis, the finance community at large and regulators realized the importance of modeling extreme events. I like this anecdote told by Professor Embrecht from Risk Lab, ETH Zurich, which is a partner of CREA. When being invited at the Fed in New York in 1999, he alerted the authority about the danger to work on the normality assumption only, that they should not ignore extreme events. Also, Professor Embrecht is one of the most recognized mathematicians in both academic and professional worlds. People did not take this warning seriously, preferring to think that it was only an academic concern. Ten years later, they asked him to come back to advise them on tools for modeling extremes. We have also seen during the crisis that the dependence between all financial markets become very important, making diversification of the portfolio almost impossible. Hence, the urgent need to take into account both heavy tails and non-linear dependence of risk. In financial markets, we are confronted to risk. The fundamental difference between risk and uncertainty is that risk is by definition measurable, whereas uncertainty is not. Hence, the importance of quantifying correctly risk, not to avoid crisis, which will always exist, but to be better prepared for it and avoid dramatic situations for people. During crisis, people tend to adopt an extreme old behavior, rejecting rational and scientific approach, trying to escape on their own, while not understanding enough the bad consequences of what they are doing, thinking with short views, as often in politics. To the contrary, it should be in the time where people must be even more rational and put more effort in understanding and not blindly applying recipes. It is what we are trying to do at ESSEC, educating students to adopt a scientific and rigorous approach even when dealing with social sciences. I would reformulate the sentence human being beyond numbers by saying taking a better care of human being thanks to a better understanding of numbers. Gathering together experts to discuss extreme events in finance is very topical for drawing the lessons in the aftermath of the financial crisis. It promises to be quite interesting and lively with specialists presenting their latest results and roundtables discussing future developments and new challenges. It gives a great opportunity to participants for being confronted with the state of the art of extreme value theory and its application in finance. An international conference of that sort took already place at ESSEC in 2009 on financial risk analysis and extreme values. It will be interesting to see and compare themes and progress made since then. That is why CREA gives its full support to this conference as our Risk Research Center is fostering exchanges and communication on those topics, organizing such international events or regular meetings with the Working Group on Risk.